The Vector Robotics competition is aimed at students in key stages 3, 4 and 5. They are tasked with designing, building and programming their robots to compete in a specific engineering challenge that changes every year. They have to design their robot from scratch, they have to code it, so they have to use the sort of VEX coding suites to do that. Problem solving, team working, adaptability, and that's a really good skill to carry forward. The idea that we can build a robot that's constructive rather than destructive. It's about different types of engineering working together to create a whole thing. The teamwork element is absolutely fantastic. It's not just about beating the opposition, it's about working with them as well, forming those friendships. It's literally everything you'd want in a STEM subject. Our goal, build the robots, improve as we go along through the iterative design process and do our best to join in with the wonderful VEX community. It's a social time with my friends where we can all work together to build something and we all are a valuable member of the team and we're all essential parts of the team. I help with the designing so I look at what it is exactly that VEX has challenged us to do and I think alright okay so what do we know how to do that we can integrate into this what new things can we input that we haven't done before so that we like develop what we know we improve our skills all these creative designs and robots judging them you see all these key little differences and how each team's integrated their own unique sort of take on things right, so it's really easy to put together the main difficulty would probably be coding but even so, the, uh, the VEX coding studio gives you uh, like guidance. So even that isn't, isn't as difficult as it might seem. Well, I think the key thing with programming is that failure is good, because that's how you learn. Doing VEX is just perfect for that, because they have to really, they have to work it out. Absolutely increases their confidence, their ability to, to work through adversity. And on the technical side, design technical side, they're able to plan out, design, develop, iterate, and continually improve their work and by going to competitions regularly throughout the course of the year, they're able to see what other students can do. They get help from other teams in order to continually improve. It's absolutely fantastic. Right now, I'd say we're, we're, we're kind of lagging behind, but the thing is about VEX, like, a lot of unexpected things happen. You know, the underdogs can sometimes come out on top. To get them here in competition, just to see their faces, see them competing, to see them drop as well when they're not winning all their games, but getting a little high when they come out with a win is, is amazing. From competing in my team, honestly, I get the sense of value, you know, a, a sense of real, genuine friendships and connections. The friends I've made in this VEX group are possibly some of the best friends I've ever made. VEX has made a difference in my career choices and how I might want to go into a field where I use robots in medicine. I've witnessed so much enthusiasm. Oh, I love it. It's, it's been one of those things where every person you talk to, you think, oh, I've, I've, I've seen that before. And then they tell you something else. And you're like, oh, no, I haven't seen that before. And they really are so engrossed in what they do. And it's so wonderful to see. I'm really like, it makes me really optimistic for the future of engineering. It does because we are so short on future engineers, male, female, or whatever. We, we need more. Um, so it's great to see so many that are coming up and going, yeah, this is something exciting. It makes me really optimistic, yeah.